Greetings, friends and family of YouTube. This is Mixin' LV right here. And I figured, you know, I'll do a little bragging rights here. Not really bragging, bragging, but I just want to, like, show you guys a little something here. I'm getting these, uh, heart comments from Pokemon Master Holly. Not only from YouTube, but also Twitter. And when I've seen stuff like that, I see that she's like to interact with, you know, her viewers. She likes interacting with her viewers right here. Which led me to look at, oh, where is it? Here it is. Going through some of her videos, uh, this is actually a video where she put a heart on mine, and you can tell by looking through and scrolling through this, you know, she does do a whole lot. Now, I went through a few others YouTubers and see, what do you guys do? Are you actually watching your comment section, what everyone's saying here, you know? Because that's important to at least communicate with people in your chat, in chats here, whether it is like, you know, YouTube, Twitter, anything like that. Uh, this is Nick from Trainer Tips right here. I don't, I don't see one just yet. I'm not scrolling all the way through all these videos either. Reversal. He's doing a few here. I noticed that. Let's see one, two, three. If I keep scrolling down, I probably find a bit more. I just uh, you know, went through this real quick. It's like, all right, how many is he liking here right off the bat? Of course, I was days old for a video. Some of these actually make sense why you heart thumbs. Like, yep, there you go. Oh, there's that again. Sparky Joy is doing the same thing. She's putting hearts on, uh, you know, people that are saying good things about her. She is paying attention to her uh, section as well. And who else was this? I also looked at Mystic7. What is he doing here? I'm sorry, I'm not subscribed to him yet. <laughs> Is he communicating with his uh, fellow fans here? You know, the communication does help out in the long run. You know, I don't see one just yet. It could, they could have been pushed way down at the bottom and I just can't see them. There's a possibility of that or nothing's got pinned on there. Like, you get the hint I'm saying here, right? You know, I also understand that you are super busy with what you do. Also, you have no time indeed to We'll look through all your comment sections, especially when you have over 100 or 700 or even 1,000 comments. So no hard feelings, you know. When I see stuff like you know, like this right here, you know that 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 tells you something there. They, they like to communicate with the fans. Now, whether if you are like you know a normal person like me, or you're some troll that's trying to, you know, sit there and do whatever to anger them, which I'm not trying to do that, obviously. But hey, you know. I felt like making this video about it, like, you know, I feel comfortable watching her videos more often than anyone else's. It's like, gee, I wonder why. But, you know, that's that's a prime example why, you know, continue to watch on. I remember last year watching Trainer Tips and Mystic 7 videos all the time, and I never get stuff like this at all up until just recently, this summer, with all the other YouTubers within this Pokemon Go community, and including Holly now. I'm starting to get hearts like crazy just for commenting on videos. Hmm, I wonder why. Good communication is way to get your way going with, you know, your way through YouTube, obviously. All right, so now we're in the wrong shirt and hat, but whatever. I'm going not to do a vlog. I don't want this up videos getting uploaded. But anyways, thank you all for watching. Have a good one. And if you are a YouTuber, if you are a YouTuber sitting there making videos, try to communicate with the people you're having comments with, all right? There are people that's commenting on your videos, people that, you know, it's in your Twitter group, at least, you know, chat with people. Thank you all for watching. Have a good one.